Did you ever hear the terrifying true story of how Stephen King came up with the idea for the famous movie, The Shining? Here it is. Nestled in the picturesque Rocky Mountains of Colorado, the Stanley Hotel stands as a grand testament to a bygone era. Built in 1909 by Freeland Oscar Stanley, the hotel boasts stunning architecture and breathtaking views. However, it's not the opulence or natural beauty that makes the Stanley Hotel famous. It's the terrifying tales of the supernatural that have plagued it for over a century. The Stanley Hotel's eerie reputation was solidified by one fateful night in 1974, when author Stephen King and his wife Tabitha checked into room 217. King was seeking solitude to work on his novel, The Shining. Little did he know that his stay at the Stanley Hotel would inspire one of the most iconic horror novels and films of all time. Room 217 had a sinister history even before King's arrival. In 1911, a housekeeper named Elizabeth Wilson was involved in a gas explosion while lighting the lanterns in the room. Miraculously, she survived, but her spirit, it seems, never left. Guests who have stayed in room 217 have reported strange occurrences, lights flickering, phantom footsteps, and even the sensation of someone tucking them into bed at night. During King's stay, he experienced a vivid nightmare of his son being chased through the hotel by a fire hose. He awoke in a cold sweat, realizing that The Shining would be set in this haunted hotel. The eerie atmosphere, unsettling events, and the Stanley Hotel's paranormal history fueled his imagination, giving birth to the terrifying tale of the Torrance family and their descent into madness. But the Stanley Hotel's haunting extends well beyond Room 217. Throughout its history, numerous guests and staff members have reported paranormal encounters. The fourth floor in particular is notorious for inexplicable activity. Doors that refuse to stay closed, phantom laughter echoing in the hallways, and the sensation of an unseen presence are all part of the eerie ambiance that pervades the floor. In addition to the fourth floor, the concert hall of the Stanley Hotel is a hot spot for supernatural activity. Pianos have been known to play by themselves and ghostly apparitions have been sighted dancing in the moonlit ballroom. One particular photograph taken in the concert hall shows an eerie figure at the top of the stairs. Its identity, a mystery to this day. The hotel's basement is another place of dread. Once used as a speakeasy during Prohibition, the basement holds the lingering spirits of the past. Guests have reported feeling an oppressive presence, strange voices, and an overwhelming sense of unease. Some believe that the spirits of those who indulged in secret gatherings still linger in this dimly lit underworld. The Stanley Hotel has also become a hub for paranormal investigators and enthusiasts. Countless ghost hunting groups have descended upon the hotel, equipped with cameras, EVP, electronic voice phenomena, recorders, and other ghost detecting devices. Many have captured unexplained phenomena, such as disembodied voices, shadowy figures, and mysterious orbs of light. One chilling incident involved a psychic medium named Rosemary Timperley, who visited the Stanley Hotel in the 1970s. While dining in the hotel's restaurant, she claimed to have made contact with several spirits, including that of Freeland Oscar Stanley himself. Timperley detailed conversations with the spirits, revealing their unfinished business and lingering attachments to the hotel. Even the staff members at the Stanley Hotel have their own tales of the supernatural, from doors slamming shut on their own to apparitions appearing in their peripheral vision. Many employees have had hair-raising experiences while working at the hotel. Some have even described a feeling of being watched, especially in the dimly lit hallways. Despite the haunting reputation, the Stanley Hotel remains a popular destination for thrill seekers, ghost hunters, and fans of the macabre. It embraces its eerie history offering ghost tours and themed events that cater to those who dare to explore its haunted corridors. Whether you believe in the supernatural or not, 
the chilling stories surrounding the Stanley Hotel have etched themselves into the annals of American horror. The hotel's mysterious aura continues to captivate and terrify visitors, leaving them with an unforgettable, spine-tingling experience that defies rational explanation. The Stanley Hotel stands as a true life horror story, where the line between reality and the paranormal blurs and the echoes of the past still linger in the shadows.